Hi guys, VST here, Valens Peaks Tech, and yes, I have the Samsung Galaxy S10 Plus updated to the latest One UI 2.5. If you own the Samsung Galaxy S10 Plus and you can re-wait to get it over the air, then please check here my video on how to download the German firmware which has the One UI 2.5 included right right now it is only available for the exynos version of the samsung galaxy s10 plus but guys i want to make this video because it's very very important that we understand is this really true that right now you can enjoy the android 10 full screen navigation gestures on external launchers which previously was not an option with the one ui 2.1 with the one ui 2 the gestures the full screen navigation gestures only worked with the stock one ui is used as a launcher but every time you have installed a third party launcher like the poco launcher like the nova launcher like the long chair there was the problem that the gestures the full screen gestures did not work and right now we are hearing the word that one ui 5 is actually compatible with android 10's full screen navigation gestion when they're used in this third party app launchers and the full screen navigation gestures are seen to be working on many devices right now of course i have the s10 plus and i will test this in my video so i will install a couple of custom launchers guys and we're gonna see together if this claim is really true so right now i'm running the one way 5 android 10 and i'm gonna see if the full screen navigation gestures are really compatible and do really work inside third-party applications and we know that actually Google released this feature last year and Samsung took a year to bring it here to our devices but now this should work so I'm directly going to go to the Play Store and I'm just going to download the Poco launcher all right so there is a person that wanted me to do so so hi Peter if you're watching this video that's for you all right so that's one goes for Peter guys downloading Poco launcher this might be a little bit weird, you know, installing the Poco Launcher on my Samsung S10 Plus device, but I just want to do it. I just want to see if this really will work. Okay, recommended. I'm going to go apply setting the wallpaper. I will agree to the terms of services. I will allow the Poco Launcher to access my photos and I will apply it. And guys, let's see if the transformation here will happen or not. Okay, set Poco as your default launcher to discover more features and personalized services. All right, I will do so. So if I go now to the default home app, guys, you can see I have already the CPL, the launcher, the One UI Home and the Poco launcher. Okay, oh my God. <laughs> oh yeah. Oh, that, that's really, really, really strange. Okay, swipe right twice in the app drawer to view hidden app icons, okay. Even that one works. I think all the back gesture. So, okay, let me just see. If I open here YouTube, all right, can I go back? Absolutely, you can go back. Insane. I mean, oh my God. I really have a feeling right now that I'm not using the Samsung S10 Plus with the latest One UI 2.5, but rather using a MIUI phone, a phone with a MIUI, like a Xiaomi phone. Okay, let me just try to do some other things, guys. Okay, let me just try to open settings here. Okay, so let's see. I'm gonna right now test the this gesture, okay? So apparently, you know, the reasons work, okay? Now let's see here, ah, ah, okay, you see I have the overlay right now, okay? Camera also works, okay? I have camera, I have reasons, all right. Now let's see if I do like this, okay? I'm just gonna go back, okay? So let's just go back in the camera, do a swipe here, all right. Let's see if I just do a swipe twice, I should be able to see hidden icons, okay? I'm not sure if that works. But guys, apparently we can now really prove that the gestures apparently do really work. And that's insane, guys. And I'm just going to also test the long chair, right? So let me just go to home settings. I have navigated to my default apps and now I'm going to change my home app from the Poco launcher to the long chair. Okay, and let's see what happens, guys. Create widget and low access. Okay, why not? Let's do it. I just press create. Okay. And now let's see if we have, okay, we just see, by the way, we just see, I have right now long chair and we can just see right, that all my gestures work. So if I swipe like this, I'm gonna get to the applications, right? Let me just open the camera again. If you gonna swipe like this, we just go to the recents, okay? And let's go in the camera and let's see if I do it like that, boom, I go back. I think guys, with that, we can 100% prove that right now, all the full screen navigation gestures from Android 10 absolutely and flawlessly work 
on the Samsung Galaxy S10 Plus using the latest One UI 2 to 5. And again, this is, I think, very much awaited. It's really a huge leap because this can or this will bring a lot of traction to One UI users, guys. Right now, they can change the One UI stock launcher. They can get a different, a new experience with using the same flawless and really perfect phone, so I'm really happy with that. By the way, I'm just saying it once again, if you wanna see my review of the Pro View mode, you can see the view here and also understand how to manually install a German firmware which has the One UI 2.5 already incorporated, guys. So if you don't wanna wait, do it like this. Today is Friday, so I will say this. Have a very nice rest of the day and hopefully we're looking ahead for a great weekend, guys, with One UI 2.5. Bye.